Los Angeles, the year-round home of the movie and television industries, is where the biggest stars live, work, and play. And they don't stay in just any old hotel. Los Angeles luxury hotels serve to the modern version of royalty, and there's no extravagance they can't supply and no particular request they can't accommodate, all while keeping you safe from the paparazzi's watchful eye. Hey everyone, this is Troy here from Jess's Top 10 Reviews. Today, we're going to take a look inside the 10 most luxurious hotels in Los Angeles. So, without further ado, let's get into it. Number 10. W Hollywood Following in the footsteps of Madonna and Cher, who only go by one name, W is instantly recognized by a single sound. W Hollywood is a fun brand, influenced by music, fashion, and location, and it blends in with the surrounding recording studios and boutiques. It's a location where the old and new clash, with decor inspired by the swinging 1960s in its 305 hotel rooms and suites overlooking the star-studded Hollywood Walk of Fame and immediately across from the iconic Pantages Theatre. The extreme WOW suite has a magnificent curved leather sofa and deep marble bath, while the sound suite has its own recording studio and mixing desk. Aside from the suites, there's also the wet deck rooftop pool and two amazing restaurants, Delphine Eatery and Station Hollywood, serving up classic American dishes. Number 9. Intercontinental Los Angeles Downtown, an IHG Hotel When it comes to five-star Los Angeles hotels, it's go big or go home, and the Intercontinental Los Angeles is a prime example. It not only houses the Western Hemisphere's tallest open-air bar, Spire 73, but also La Boucherie, a luxury sky-high steakhouse with over 1,000 bottles of hand-selected wine ready to pour. Its 889 guest rooms and suites are equally remarkable, with each taking full use of the breathtaking views. If there's one room worth seeing, it's the presidential suite, which has a piano in the parlor and a light-filled king bedroom that's like sleeping in the clouds. High-speed double-decker elevators transport guests of this premium hotel between the 70th floor sky lobby and the ground floor in just 40 seconds, ensuring that you don't have to wait long if you want to go exploring. Number 8. Pendry West Hollywood Action, action, action! Pendry West Hollywood, perched above the renowned Sunset Strip, is a regular haunt of the Hollywood A-list, so don't be shocked if you notice a celebrity or two hanging out at its ultra-glam clubs and restaurants. Bar Pendry's decor is on point, think gilded lounges and a reflecting ceiling, but sister venue Merois, an Asian fusion restaurant from acclaimed chef Wolfgang Puck, gives it a run for its money. The pool is also a popular area for an evening beverage. Number 7. The Peninsula Beverly Hills The Peninsula Hong Kong is one of the world's most opulent hotels, with its downtown Beverly Hills sister property just adds to that reputation, bringing the richness of the original and a splash of California soul. The 195 rooms, suites and private villas are decorated in the style of a French castle, with large mirrors, floral draperies and a neutral color scheme that evokes instant serenity. The Belvedere's sun-dappled outdoor dining area, as well as a roof garden, club bar, and living room where guests can have high tea, are all available for eating. Guests who book a suite are given free use of a sleek BMW for the duration of their stay, allowing them to cruise up the Pacific Coast Highway to Malibu or continue past Santa Barbara to Santa Ina's wine country. Number 6. Shutters on the Beach Shutters began as the left coast's interpretation of an east coast beach home, but with Pacific sunsets and furnishings designed by the man who worked on the Obama White House residence, it swiftly evolved into much more. If you're traveling for work, this is the ideal location to ensure that vacation vibe during your little downtime. You're in luck if you're traveling for pleasure. Please keep in mind that many rooms do not offer a full ocean view, so be sure to book the ones that do for the ultimate beach house experience. Number 5. Fairmount Miramar Hotel and Bungalows The Fairmount Miramar is a typical Santa Monica hotel, serving as both a garden hideaway and a beach base camp. The mattresses are dressed in fret linens, and the top floor suites have two balconies, although the 31 residential bungalows are the choice pick. One unexpected benefit of staying here? Access to the exclusive Miramar Beach Club, 
The staff will even drive you from the lobby in BMWs as if you were in a music video. Number 4. Waldorf Astoria Beverly Hills Old Hollywood glitz with a modern twist. That's exactly the Waldorf Astoria Beverly Hills. It stands to reason, given that its French designer, Pierre-Yves Rochon, is also responsible for the famed Shangri-La Paris and the Savoy London. Since its debut in 2017, the hotel has received a flurry of accolades, with each of its 170 pastel and cream rooms and suites exuding classic French elegance. Its location at the intersection of Wilshire and Santa Monica Boulevards makes it an ideal starting point for exploring the city. Number 3. Ritz-Carlton Los Angeles The Ritz-Carlton stands out among the hotels in downtown Los Angeles for more than simply its size. It was unlike any other hotel nearby when it opened in 2010 as part of the bustling LA Live Entertainment and Eating Zone, and its dazzling luster has not faded. Guests can choose from 123 bright and airy rooms and suites, an exclusive Ritz-Carlton club level and bar, a day spa, and a stunning rooftop pool with views of the Hollywood Hills. There's practically little incentive to leave the luxury confines of the hotel, but if you do, there's much to see and do nearby. There's never a shortage of stage concerts and events to attract your attention at the Staples Center, Microsoft Theater, and Grammy Museum, as well as just down the road from Crypto.com Arena and the Los Angeles Convention Center. Number 2. Fairmont Century Plaza Century Plaza, which first opened its doors in 1966, is a mainstay in the Los Angeles hotel landscape. If its walls could talk, they would mention prior visitors, such as Elton John, Paul McCartney, and Sonny and Cher, not to mention the Grammy and Emmy Awards that were once held there. Fairmont Century Plaza is poised to continue its leading role in the LA heritage for decades to come as the centerpiece of a $2.5 billion, yes, billion, makeover of the site, which has seen the addition of two 44-story towers and 268 privately owned condominiums. Minoru Yamasaki built the crescent-shaped symbol as the hotel of the future, and it now includes 400 exquisite rooms, 80 magnificent condominiums, a spacious health spa, and a rooftop pool. Number 1. Four Seasons Los Angeles at Beverly Hills Four Seasons hotels are synonymous with luxury, with beautifully styled rooms, outstanding service, and a fantastic location. The Four Seasons Los Angeles at Beverly Hills checks all of the boxes, and its recent $33 million refurbishment has improved it even further. The Four Seasons LA is well positioned for exploration, close to the fashion forward boutiques of Rodeo Drive and within easy reach of Santa Monica Boulevard. But there's plenty to enjoy on site as well, including a resort pool with cabanas and an inviting day spa. Top tier suite guests also receive the exclusive Doheny experience, which includes a plain to suite meet and greet, curbside or subterranean VIP arrival, and butler service upon request. Some suites even have a Range Rover for your usage during your stay, almost enough to attract the attention of the paparazzi. So, which is your favorite hotel in Los Angeles? Let us know in the comment section down below. With that being said, here we come to the end of our video. I hope you like this video. If so, then don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you never miss any video. See you in the next video. Till then, take care. Thanks for watching.